Hey guys, Lapeller back with another video. Oh wait, this is actually my first cycling vlog. I really do hope you guys enjoy it. I put a lot of work in it and obviously because it's my first cycling vlog, at least officially, before in the past I've done it, but now I've stepped up my camera equipment and tried doing my best to keep you guys engaged and interested. A lot of you guys do ask me what the type of training and riding I do, so I thought it was about time that I bring you guys this content, especially with the weather here in Toronto, Canada being so nice. And bear with me, this is my first time really vlogging the quality and the content and just the flow of it is going to get better as I get a hang of it. So just give me some time to get used to it. It's still new to me, especially when I'm used to training just, you know, with music or listen to an audiobook. So I'm getting used to it in terms of the flow of when to bring the camera out when not to, when to just ride, when to give you guys an update. So just give me time and as the vlogs progress, they'll get better and more interesting. I really hope you guys do enjoy the vlog. I had a lot of fun making it and I'm very excited to continue making them in the future. So let's watch this vlog right now. Hey guys, Lip Peddler back with another video. Today, I'm bringing you along for a ride with me and just to see some of the type of training that I do. So stay tuned and it will be a good one. So guys, today I have a chill, chill little ride. I'm still recovering from the race I participated in on Saturday, so my legs are still feeling it. So today is just active recovery. It's been like that for the past three days. I tried to actually, my, uh, my fatigue, and it was actually crazy. It was really high up there. Right now we're going up a little 3% gradient. No cars, really nice today. Really good weather. They say it's gonna thunderstorm later on today, but I don't know. Do you guys think it's gonna thunderstorm? I don't think so. It depends if we have a funny cloud coming in that wants to wreck our little party. So today I have about 70 kilometers in the agenda. Whoops, that was some gravel. 70K in the agenda. Right now my heart rate's 140. Car's behind me. Oh. Looks like a truck, but uh, really respectful here, guys. I don't know where you guys live, but our, comment in the section below. Does the cars respect you? Because they respect me very nicely. It might be because I have a light on my bike, but uh, yeah, I'm just really enjoying it. Easy, uh, easy pace right here. So guys, bear with me. This is my very first cycling vlog. Well, actually it's not. I've already posted, I think, two on my channel. I know I definitely posted one, but you know, I'm getting used to it. It's pretty interesting to uh, keep you guys up to date with the riding that I do outside, and I'm really enjoying it. So, you know, there's gonna be a pretty big climb up ahead. So I'll keep you guys posted and just enjoy the ride. So far, did some climbing, pretty chill. Now it's just nice flats. Like I say in all my videos, a lot of rolling flats where I live. So really nice just to spin the legs out, get them moving, not having them so tired. Amazing, amazing. But 30 minutes into the ride, 15K is done. Super enjoyable, big truck. And I'll show you guys the opposite view. So guys, this is where I'm riding right now. Hella beautiful, look at that. That's gonna be a windy descent. Obviously can't film there unless I had my GoPro on, which I do not. And it'd be kind of dangerous, but for right now I'm refueling and I'm gonna flip the camera and explain what's so important with fueling on the bike. So refueling on the bike is so important, making sure that you're on top of your water intake and also your nutrition is probably the most important thing. Everyone forgets it. They're more you know, focused on the route, which is important. But you know, refueling is probably the most important thing that you can do. We'll wait for this car to pass. It just passed me pretty close. Dangerous, 
But uh, yeah, refueling is really important. You should be taking about 60 grams of carbohydrates. If you guys do want to see a video of what I eat on the bike and just my fueling strategy, like the video, subscribe to the channel. And uh, yeah, I'm almost an hour into this ride, got an hour left. It is just so beautiful. It's days like today that I appreciate. And you know, for the next while, for a long time, because I guess summer's officially here, this is gonna be almost a daily thing, guys. So I'm really excited. I hope wherever you guys are riding is super nice as well. Absolutely gorgeous. I just love this area so much. As you guys can see, weather's nice. I just burped. Weather's nice, everything's nice. So guys, outside right now, we are more than an hour in, uh, 32 kilometers. Why am I clapping my hands? Round of applause for the ride. But anyways, I don't want to disturb anyone because this is someone's recycling that we're using to actually prop it up. But other than that, the weather's looking really nice, guys. I keep saying that, but it's just that I'm so happy summer is finally here in terms of good quality ride. That cloud is amazing. Um, really makes the shot. It, it looks photoshopped. Like imagine I put one right here, boom. And then another one below it. Uh, do that in post. But other than that guys, why did, why did I just flex my arm? Um, but other than that guys, everything's looking pretty much nice in terms of the ride. Cars are being very respectful. So that's what's nice to see. You don't really like it when people are rude in terms of cars being really close to you and not giving you space, especially look how empty the roads are. You can easily pass me very nicely. That guy passed me and I wasn't even on the side of the road. So thank you, thank you. Um, but other than that, uh, let's get rolling again. So we're gonna be continuing to roll. And because I was always indoors for a lot of my riding, super important that we remember to refuel in terms of hydration because I am sweating a lot. So super important that I just, you know, remember and I'm doing it every 10 minutes, making sure that I drink. So I'll keep you guys posted. So I'm currently cycling along and we see the lights. I thought it was a train actually, but I guess it's just to tell you, be careful because I think this is an emergency area. So I guess I just got pranked. I thought, I thought we were gonna see a train. That's why I took out my phone, but slow. I don't think we can go slow. We can only go fast, baby. So that about wraps it up for the ride. It was about 61 kilometers. So average speed was around 30, 30.5. If you guys do want to see the pictures I took while I was riding, follow my Instagram and Strava. But all in all, I think now the clouds are still looking nice. So I don't see any rainstorm in sight as of right now, but we're almost home. Now it's just a cool down. It's always good to do a proper cool down so you don't shock your muscles just from going really hard and then all of a sudden stopping uh, when you get home. So always doing a cool down is super important and that's what I'm doing right now. So that about wrap. Bruh. So that about wraps it up for the first vlog with the new camera. Hope you guys did enjoy it. If you guys did, feel free to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more, more cycling content coming very soon. So stay tuned for that. And until the next one, keep on pedaling.